Michelle Rodriguez in a leather bra? Check. Cheech Marin as a gun-toting priest? Check. Danny Trejo using a guy's intestines as rope? Double check. This is just a sampling of what to expect from the blood-soaked, sex-filled machete. Writer-director Robert Rodriguez's expansion of his popular fake trailer from 2007's Grindhouse. The desperado filmmaker's ode to the mexploitation genre, the film delivers everything promised in that trailer, and then some. Opening with a full frontal assault that features more death and nudity in five minutes than most R-rated films do in their entirety, the movie stars Trejo as Machete, a Mexican federale who's double-crossed by a drug lord played by Steven Seagal. Of course, you can't get rid of a guy named Machete that easily. Our hero, or anti-hero, soon makes his way to the States, where Rodriguez takes the time to touch upon some topical political commentary. Got your papers? Same as the last time you checked. But don't worry, this movie's more interested in ruthless assassins, brutal militia, and naked Lindsay Lohans than it is the 14th Amendment. When he's hired to kill a slimy senator played by Robert De Niro, Machete is double-crossed again, but this time he's got a few amigos in his corner, including Rodriguez, Marin, and Jessica Alba as an immigration officer with a big gun. For some, the fake trailer might be all they need of Machete, and it's fine to leave it at that. But one has to admire what the filmmakers have done with the seed of an idea and three minutes of footage. The film pushes beyond realism and into the realm of the extreme. In fact, it's so over the top at times, you may find yourself laughing and cringing. And that's worth three and a half stars if you ask us.